If a person's identity depends on qualities that can crumble, he or she is in danger of despair, for without a sense of self we are nothing, and the world is unmoved by our existence. If everything should fade, what will be left of me? We live in fear of this loss of self, our existential crisis. I am called Lucatil. I come from Mira, a land of knights. My sword is always ready. There is only one way up in Mira. Join the Order and prove yourself in battle. My family had little fortune and no name. I had to carve out a piece of the world for myself. With two things. My sword and my loyalty to my lord. I was raised to wield a sword from birth. Life was hard, but I never gave it a second thought. I had swift success on the battlefield and quickly attained respectable stature. And then I... And then I came here to... Who are you? We came to Drang Lake seeking answers. Our flesh, like many others of humanity, is branded with the dark sign of the undead. While marked, an undead's memory of their humanity will fade, until only a hollow husk remains. Undeath robs us of our past, and in doing so, it robs us of our fate. Lucatil was marked, and she bears it with shame, for it forced her out of her homeland. Across many kingdoms, the appearance of this curse and those who bear it has been met with fear and hatred. The King of Iron bound the undead in chains, and tortured them endlessly. The current King of Light did much the same, sending them to an inescapable Bastille. It is not so strange to think that the land of Mira would have reacted in much the same manner, damning Lucatil if it was ever discovered what she had become. Have you heard of the undead? These poor souls affected by the curse. An undead gradually loses his humanity until his wits degrade completely. Finally, he turns hollow and preys upon others. And a hollow can never be human again. One can skirt this wicked fate only with the help of the souls found here. Assuming, of course, that the legends are true, I can only hope that they are. The mask hides Lucatil's shame. It is said that Drangleic holds the souls that can cure the curse. Many adventurers rose to the call, some driven by greed, others by desperation. For Lucatil, Drangleic holds salvation. I found my thoughts growing hazy. My memories are fading, oldest first. The curse is doing its work upon me. I am frightened. Terribly so. If everything should fade, what will be left of me? Existential despair. The curse took her knighthood, the thing she devoted her life to. Lucatil's self was based on her prowess as a knight and her loyalty to her lord. Forced to leave for Drang Lake, what does she have left? She will lose herself, given time. She will lose that which made her what she is. Oh, you, my thoughts, are very scattered. <laughs> what is this curse? The question rings in my mind, but I haven't the focus to answer it. Loss frightens me no end. Loss of memory, loss of self. If I were told that by killing you, I would be freed of this curse, then I would draw my sword without hesitation. I don't want to die. I want to exist. I would sacrifice anything, anything at all for this. It shames me, but it is the truth. Sometimes I feel obsessed with this insignificant thing called self. 
Even so, I am compelled to preserve it. Am I wrong to feel so? Surely you do the same in my shoes. Maybe we're all cursed. From the moment we're born. All of us face this same despair. Cursed or not, there is no meaning in the world, beyond what meaning we give it. Despite this, we seek meaning. For a life free of purpose simply means that we are able to imprint our own. We are all a product of our past, and this shapes our future. But an undead is doomed to lose his past, and thus fated to be robbed of his future. Lucatil has one hope, to find her past and recover who she was. I had an older brother. We learned to fence together. He became the most decorated swordsman in all of Mira. I never even compared to him. In fact, I never beat him. Not once. But then, one day, he was gone. Lost without a trace. Now I'm certain that he was taken by the curse. If only someone would hear my tale. My brother must have come here, too. Soon I may forget even about him. An undead gradually loses his humanity until his wits degrade completely. Finally, he turns hollow and preys upon others. You... What's become of you? Oh, my dear brother. I won't die in this foul place. You... Who are you? Oh... No, forgive me. I know you. Yes, of course. How goes your journey? We find Lucatil here after her help in countless battles and right before her finding her brother. It is assumed that they have fought, but it is not known. Perhaps she never met him, perhaps it's better that way, for he has lost himself and attacks others to rob them of their humanity. Regardless, Lucatil never progresses further, so it is here, outside of Aldia's keep, that her journey ends. I know not what you seek in this faraway land, but I pray for your safety. My name is Lucatil. I beg of you remember my name, for I may not myself. Existential despair is a universal human condition. There is no meaning in the world, and yet we seek it insatiably. Hey guys, if you liked that video, then you can click the bonfire and become a part of the small group that supports this channel. Uh, it takes you to Patreon, where you can give a dollar or two dollars a month to get rewards like seeing videos early, and it really helps me out, and it keeps this channel going. So, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.